three, two, one, go. Okay, this episode, it's not very, it's easier to think about it if you do it from a non-linear point of view, because it's very Moffat-y. So really the episode starts with the time war, and the Zygons have lost their their planet um, in the time war. So the Zygons steal some Time Lord tech that allows them to exist in a moment of time, and then they end up in England. Um, not sure exactly how, but they do. It doesn't matter. They're there. They're in England. And, and now the doctor's involved. <laughs> and, oh my god, this pressure. And You're doing great. You're doing great. Simultaneous to stuff happening in England, the Time War is happening. The War Doctor is faced with the choice of whether he's going to kill all the Time Lords and the Daleks to end the war. And now we have all the Doctors coming together because the Time Lord, the, sorry, the the War Doctor steals other tech that allows this thing to open because it has a consciousness and it's trying to guide him to make the right decision. And now all the Doctors are together and they need to simultaneously stop the Zygon invasion happening on Earth and also figure out what to do with the Time Lord, Time War. And they think that the War Doctor has killed everyone, but he hasn't yet. So they guide him to make the decision to not kill everyone. And then Tom Baker shows up at the end. And um, it's very and lovely. Time. And Thor's there. <laughs> hey. That was All so right. hard. Good job. 